Hi guys, it's Tina from Bonkies. Today I'm going to show you how to be creative with nature with all these amazing things that I picked up in my backyard. So I wonder what can we make with all these amazing things? And Haley has been talking about life cycle of a frog and um, chickens. So today I might do the life cycle of a butterfly, but I'm not going to show you how they grow. I'm going to show you how to make the little eggs. So we're going to get a little leaf and this is what I already prepared later before and I got little pom-poms to cook and that's our eggs. Also, when I was going to explore the garden in my backyard, this is what I found. And I said, perfect, I can use that for my caterpillar. And then I got an idea, I need to make a cocoon. So I used this little branch here to make a cocoon. So that is how we do that. And another amazing thing, I made a butterfly. And I used the little sticks and the raffia to put around it with some leaves. So do you think you can make that? I'm going to show you how to make other ways of the butterflies. So I'm going to get some natural leaves that I also find in my backyard and the bark. So I'm going to get creative here. So I'm going to pop these ones like little wings and I'm going to put that one there. And I'm just going to place it in here. And also we'll need some sticky tape. So I got a little bit of sticky tape prepared for myself here. So it's a bit easier. So you can do that. So I'm just going to sticky tape on this one. And I'm just going to show it that way. And I'm going to find also put these two together. And I'm going to sticky type it. Even the sticky type is being a bit funny today. So I'm just going to put it all together. And now we got a beautiful butterfly. But I think it's missing something. What do you think it's missing? Hmm, let's find out. So this is the other things I found in my backyard. So I got a little branch. So I'm just going to put it like this break it in two and I'm going to also use my little sticky tape that I already have prepared here and I'm going to sticky tape the little antennas and we got a little butterfly you also need some eyes but you can use a texture to draw some eyes or you can even make it with something. What do you think you can do? There's other things that are made with a butterfly. How cool is that one? You also can color it to be different colors. You can use different leaves by use these natural ones. And also for the younger children, you can just get a little peg and put it all together and we get a butterfly and you can draw some eyes. So please, let me know what can you make with all these amazing natural materials when you go in your mom's and dad's backyards and then you can show me below. Thank you everyone. I'll see you later soon.